Well, Jeff, homeowners in one Sherman Oaks neighborhood hope high-tech security cameras they've installed will keep criminals away, and that's because they're able to read license plates. CBS 2's Rachel Kim has a look at this technology. 600 cars a day going through here, and it's a quiet street. You'd never think so, but it's real busy when you start looking. Robert Chantel should know. He's not only lived in this Sherman Oaks neighborhood south of Valley Vista for 10 years, he's now one of three homeowners who has eyes on all the cars in his community. That's after he and his neighbors decided to pay for these license plate readers from Flock Safety to be installed at both entry points to a closed loop of streets. Here's one, here's the other. You can't get in or out of this neighborhood without going past these cameras. It does shine an infrared light on the plate to help the system get a good read on them. Robert tells us once images are captured, they're uploaded into an encrypted cloud server. If a resident becomes a victim of a crime, they can request a search for all the cars that were in the neighborhood on that date and between a certain time frame. You can even search by the type of car or color if you know it. Here you guys are. Look. So you guys did come up just recently. Your license plate, white van, first day in the neighborhood. Pam Doherty helped get residents on board to install the cameras in the early summer to stop criminals. She says the cameras brought neighbors together and have provided one more layer of security to what they already have. We feel it's just one more thing that we can do in case there is an incident. We can go back to that camera, we can take a look. And the police have told us time after time the only thing that really we that we can really go by is a license plate number. So far, there's been no reason to do a search, and residents want to keep it that way. We're ready for anything that does happen. These license plate readers have raised privacy concerns. Robert tells me he understands that, but also says only residents have access to the footage, and the footage is automatically deleted after 30 days. Reporting from Sherman Oaks, Rachel Kim, CBS 2 News.